Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Welcome if you're new here. So I already started opening it and I opened something that I probably shouldn't have shown you. It was the code to get into the game, but can you guys call what we're gonna play here? The nice the fun scenic game. Um yeah, I wanna like like do we have like what is there for a better camera view? Just out of curiosity. I know like an actual camera would be nice, but um, this is all I have for now, but I'm curious. I know I have, I need a USB to PC thing or a USB to whatever it's called so I can have multiple things going. So, of course, we have our Seen It board game. I don't know if you guys remember playing these games. Um, I want, I bought a new one. I have like four or five of them, but you need a DVD player and I don't have, I don't have one on me. Um... So, so what it shows here, I'm going to just cover this, it has the QR code here, and then where my hand is covered, it has the things, the numbers. Okay, so, I think how it works is... From what I remember, okay, there's nothing, that's just cute. Okay, so what I remember is you have your dice, you have your buzz cards, and then they'll tell you, um, then, okay. Actually, I have scissors, I have scissors. I'm excited. I haven't played in a long I haven't played this game in a long time. I love these I love these games. Okay. Okay, so we have the buzz thing. Right? I'm gonna just shuffle these quickly. Do a quick shuffle. Um, buzz goes right on this here. I love seeing it. I'm so excited. <laughs> buzz goes right there. And then we're gonna open these guys up. I'm gonna open up one package. I don't really wanna open up both. I'm gonna open up half one so that it's not, you know. And then we really pick a character as always. So let me show you the characters here. One, okay, so these are. Okay, I see how this works. So these are all the different ones. We have the old movie, old version of playing a movie. We have the old version of a camera. I guess you could be like, oh, I mean, that works. We have the start. And we have, of course, popcorn. Uh, which one should I be? I want to be. I'm gonna do start. Okay, start or roll the action thing, whatever that's called. So it looks like there's only up to four players. Kind of sucks because I think you can have more than four. Um, I need my phone. I need to enter in the code. It's nice because it's a lot less to worry about. Okay. Two, nine, seven. 
Okay, continue. So you do have to make a profile, just so you are aware of that. <clears throat> so activate game and you want to put in the code again which is kind of funny okay and let's play so uh, I don't know, this thing is really touchy. Oh, it's an app. So, that's okay. I'll just play it on here, eh? I'm gonna probably delete some of these things. We'll see. <sighs> if it was an app, I should have just said it. But, let's do this, okay. I have to sign in for like the third time. Probably will have to do the code as well. Hopefully not. I think that's a pain in the butt. Okay, why are you so sticky? Okay. Let's try this. Yeah. Okay, so I'm going to I want it to fly. Okay, so it looks like quick categories. Okay, so we need the reference. We need this reference here which shows the categories. I'm just gonna keep it quiet for a moment. So now let's say I go the dice and then the um, symbols of what we're playing. So I'm gonna do dice go up four, four, and then we'll roll this, that, so all play, so, right, so I'm trying to remember it off by heart, but we all play and we all have to guess, and then what happens if who guesses, I can't remember how this works, a hundred percent, I remember some of it, so all play, the Game Master host selects all play from the game menu. All players should watch the challenge that follows and attempt to be the first to clearly shout out the correct answer. If the player whose turn it is happens to be the first to answer correctly, they roll both dice and take another turn. If a player other than the player whose turn it is, it is answers correctly, that player chooses to either move their game piece forward one space or to force another player to draw a buzz card and takes their turn after this is done and then the next player in sequence takes their turn. Okay, so you could choose to move forward, right? 
Um, so the player chooses to either move their game piece forward in one space or to force. Um, so if the if I say it was my turn, uh, the all play and I got the all play correct, <clears throat> I take another turn. If it's a player, if it's a different player whose turn it was not, who's other than whose turn it was, then they get to move it forward or force another player to take a buzz card. Okay, that's for all play. So let's see what we get. Let's see if we could get this. By the way, I'm screen recording it, so maybe you'll see it. I'm just, I might keep it silent just in case. The first to shout out. Okay. Oh uh, no. Hotel for dogs. Hotel for dogs. Yes, I did it. I get to move. I get to go again. Well, obviously. Okay, so it was one of those like um like you know hangman where you kind of pick the letter. It was, it was putting the letters up for me. Okay, let's try it again. So, do, 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 four. <coughs> four, and then we, okay. I don't really need that. So I got the, my play, so this, this one here. So that one is just for me, I believe, right? Let me look at that. Let's look. For my play challenge, the game star host selects my play from the game menu and then my play challenge will follow. On the player whose turn it is may attempt to answer on the on-screen challenge. If the player answers correctly, they get another turn and roll both dice again. If they answer incorrectly, their turn ends and plays proceeds to the next player. And, and then if game tip, if you play seen it, many times you may eventually start seeing the same clips over again. Don't worry, each clip has multiple questions associated with it so so pay attention you never know what you will ask, be asked so when did these cards come in i don't remember when these cards come in i think that's oh that's if you get okay that's that's right okay so that's if you get different colors okay so some are the trivia cards and then like these here and then some are online and then you get the bus so we got to my play let's see what we get here my play watch the clip closely and answer the following question it play for me just play around roll around lift those legs up mm. you are a hairy little thing aren't you uh, yeah oh i like what's happening <laughs> oh that's it yeah yeah oh you little fuzz ball that's oh i got it true or false in the anchorman movies brian yeah. fantana is a sports reporter Brian Fantana is a sports reporter from the internet. I'm gonna say true. That's time. False. He's a fields He's reporter a and a ladies man. Reporter. I wasn't sure. Okay, let's do a couple more. Just because I'm sure it's like me playing all by myself here. And then I'll play with my, my boyfriend on the weekend. But it's always fun. Okay, let's do it. Okay. Uh, by the way, I'm not going to roll to go forward since it's just me. Um, you get the gist of that. So I got a star. Okay. I'm gonna, and then I'm going to go here and ask myself. Oh gosh, this, this is not going to be good. Let me know if you guys get these answers below. Um, by the way, you'll see the answers, but you know, see if you get an answer before the answer pops up. The titular character of which 1986 teen comedy, teen comedy borrowed a red 1961 Ferrari GT Spider belonging 
to his best friend's father. <gasps> I know this one. It's the guy's days off. That guy's day off. Um, shit. What's his name? Yeah, Bill? No. Michael J. Fox is in it, right? Yeah. Michael J. Fox is the main character. Uh, it's something, something day off. I'm gonna just look. Ferris Bueller's day off. I knew it was something. Ferris Bueller's day off. And I knew it was my, and Michael J. Fox was the main character. That was good. That was a good movie, actually. I'd never seen it before. I'm glad I watched it, or else I never would have even slightly remotely understood. Okay, let's do one more. And hopefully, I don't get one that's just seen it online. I get like the card. Okay. Yes, I know you. Okay. This is the same card. Actually, I'm curious about it. The tagline, this FBI agent is going undercover and he's concealing more than a weapon, is from which 2000 release movie? Miss Congeniality? Big Mama's House. Ah, oh, darn. Not even close. Here's another one out of the house. I can find it again. Okay, honestly, one more. One more, and then we're good because this is, these are fun. Okay. Movie! Oh, that's a BuzzFeed card. So perfect. So, rats, you splashed water on your pants just before your big audition. Go back two spaces while you dry out. I love seeing it. Okay. So I would have to go back two spaces. Um, but yeah, that's that's the game. Super excited to play with my friends and family. Let me know what uh, scenic game you guys used to play. I'm going to stop this recording because we have some stuff to... Yeah. Um, let me know what you guys think of scenic or what you, like, what your favorite parts of seen it was or what you oops this is a little quiet you know like what you guys used to play for scene like what your favorite scene it was or if you guys played it ever I like this version because it's you know you can it's different it's a different version and you don't have to use a dvd player but that's it for me you guys have an awesome rest of your day enjoy this game I can't wait to have more people involved in these games with me and also actually playing and, you know, just, just, yeah. Anyways, have an awesome rest of your day. Bye now.